welcome back to the channel. Um, I'm Sean. And I'm Caroline. And this is a video all about our top five rides in Animal Kingdom. So let's get right in there with our fifth favourite ride in Animal Kingdom. Um, what's yours? My fifth favourite in Animal Kingdom is Rafiki, Rafiki's Planet Watch. Is that a ride or a mode of transportation? It's a ride, you get to see things on it. Mm. Bearing in mind there's not many rides for me in, uh, in Animal Kingdom. Because Are you referring specifically to the train or the petting zoo and all the rest of it once you get there? The train, which takes you to the petting zoo. Okay. It's an adventure. Mm. To, might, to might Rafiki's Planet Watch? You might disagree, Yeah. but I'm saying it's a ride. I quite like it up there. That's quite good. My fifth favourite ride in Animal Kingdom. Can you guess? No. Primeval World. Actually, I could, probably could have guessed but Primeval World. Or Primeval Hell, if you ride it at the <laughs> right time or the wrong time, depending how you take that. But It's painful. How would you know? You've never ridden I it. I have ridden it once with you. You haven't? You've never been on Primeval World? I thought I went with you and Dad one time. Nope. You refuse to go on because it spins. Well, which one did I go on that I went on and it really was really painful? Dinosaur. No, no, it was an outdoor one like that? Nope. I bet you did. You didn't. I'm not sure I did. No, nope, you didn't. Some, oh, no, no, it was the me in um, Animal Kingdom. What? With a barnstormer. Barnstormer, you didn't like in Magic Kingdom yet? That really hurt us? Yeah. But, is that but you've similar? never ridden Primeval World. Well. Is it similar to Primeval World? Well? Nope. Nothing like it. I probably have years ago. No, you haven't. Why are you arguing with it? <laughs> I don't know, because I remember. I just vaguely remember. It's a, it's a, it's a roller coaster that you just refuse to come back to go on. Anyway, back, back to it. Why, why is it my fifth favourite? Um, it is actually quite a bit of fun. If you were the good group of people and it, you have a laugh when you're going around and if the spins are really, really good, it's just funny and a, and a good time. It does hurt a little bit. Um, it is a spinning wild mouse that you can get the world over. Um, I've ridden many versions of it in lots of different places. Um, but Primeval World is, is fun. So that's my number five. What's your number four? My number four is Cali River Rapids. Cali River Rapids. Mm. I just like the fun aspect of it and we always tend to laugh on it. It does make me a bit dizzy. Really? Uh, yeah, it makes me a little bit dizzy. Um, but it's, I think it's because it, the up and down and the, the, the okay. changes and stuff on the water rapids. But it's fun mm. and it makes us laugh mm. and I don't care about getting wet. Yeah, it's, it's not, not the best rapids right now there, but no, it's, it isn't, it's, but fun. it's fun. It's fun. Um, My number four is also Cali River Rapids going on. And why do you like Cali River Rapids? Um, because it's... Because there's not many rides in Animal Kingdom, let's be honest, so yeah. you know it, it, they have to make the list. But um, it's I like a, I like a good riv river rapids ride, um, and it's not the worst one out there. It is still good fun. Um, the story behind it has kind of been lost, I feel. Um, but in the world we live in today, with all the looking after the environment and so on, I think it's it's a good ride that they could promote a lot more um, with a little bit of a refresh and really get that idea going back because it's all about deforestation. And, that's why the, the rapids are there as well. So, yeah, good fun ride. It is. And you can get that. <laughs> That's number four. Number three. My number three is Navi River Journey. The Navi River Journey. A nice, smooth, relaxing, yeah. peaceful. I just like the prettiness of it. Enough, so yeah. the last time we were on it, there was some things down on it, but yeah, I just like the I like the music, I like mm -hmm. the peacefulness of it, and I like the pretty colours mm -hmm. and the animatronics when they do work. Yeah. Pretty. Yeah, I like that ride as well. It hasn't made my top five. I didn't think it would. No, um, but it is. It's very short. It it could be a little bit longer. Um, they could have a little drop in it, like Pirates of the Caribbean or something, I guess. But it's meant to be a peaceful ride through the. Of rainforest and so on and so on. Yeah. My number three is the other ride in Pandora, Flight of Passage. Um, it used to be my favourite ride, full stop, but it's gradually going down the list as the years go on and the more times I ride it. Um, it is 
a brilliant ride. Just the whole way that it's it's been created, the, the experience that you get, um, the queue. We've never done the normal queue, so we've not been through that. It's always been fast pass for us. Um, but the bits at the pre-shows and so on are, are, are really good fun. And then the ride itself, um, you're kind of riding on like a bike and you're flying on the Banshee. And it's breathing, um, and when that works, it's good. The smells are fantastic. Like we've got candles and stuff with the smells on it. They're that good. Um, but over time it's starting to get a little bit blurrier, especially when you're on the bottom and you're in a corner. Um, so that's why it's further down on my list, however I still really enjoy it. So that's um, Flight of Passage is my number, number three. Sean, what's your number two? My number two is Kilimanjaro Safaris, Ooh. because I love animals. Um, and the safari is a lot of fun. Um, we've ridden it all the different times of day and night, first thing, last thing, middle of the day. Um, and you, you name it, we've done it. Exactly, you get a different experience every time. Um, we load separately with Caroline in the wheelchair um, on, a, on a different truck, so that's always good um, and makes it a bit easier for Caroline. Um, and the ride itself, there's so many animals on there that you can see. Um, I do wish had more of the story that it, it used to have um, or even a newer story um, just to bring it a bit more to life that way but there is lots to see um, and learn about all those animals and that is always always a good ride in my opinion. What's your number two? My number two is Flight of Passage. Ooh. 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 Yeah very similar to Sean. I like it. I like the theme in. It does make me nauseous um, and dizzy. But I, I just think it's it's a good theme, and I like the, the smells really do it, and then the interactiveness of some of the, the waves hitting you with the water and things like that when it works. Mm -hmm. But like Sean, it makes me more dizzy now than it's ever done because of the warmthness. Um, it be, for me, it's better to sit in the middle, but I always tend to be put to the side. Yeah, heading down the path of sore a little bit. Yeah, exactly. The same kind of issue is sore for me. Um, and it depends on where we are as well, whether we are A, B, C, whatever they call it in the seating arrangements, whatever, I can't remember what it's called. Well, we're never, we've never been upstairs on that ride. Yeah. Um, the wheelchair always goes. B, B is it? I don't know. Something like that. Um, but yeah, that's, that's why I like it. But I do think they need to do something about it to try and sort it out. But you think it might be the glasses? No, I think it's just getting older. Well, Nathan said it might be the first. Yeah. Yeah, yeah that's, um, I like Flight of Passage. Really um, well done. Getting a bit old. Could do with some revamping. But the story's good as well. I like the music, the story. Yeah. It's good. So Flight of Passage is your number two. Number one. What's your number one? My number one is Kilimanjaro Safari. Ooh. Because I'm a big animal fan. I love animals, yep. I love going out there, I love being out in the, the open spaces. Um, I've, I've, I've been on it when it was the original story to what it is now, and Sean's right, they need to go back to having the story to it, because um, it does make it a little bit more fun. But I've enjoyed seeing the animals in the morning, afternoon, evening, and I just think it's, it's serene and peaceful, and sometimes it's just what you need when you want to get out with the heat, mm -hmm. and just seeing all the baby animals, the giraffes, the elephants, whatever, whenever they've had them, has been amazing and I've never disliked going on at any time and it always makes me feel good. I'm looking forward to getting back and seeing the baby zebras. Yeah, I think it's got a huge feel good, feel good factor. I think it's a good family ride. And Everyone it, can ride it. Yeah, and I've, I've been on it on the wheelchair and it's easier for me to go on the wheelchair and I was on it before I was in a wheelchair, when my mum was in a wheelchair and I just think the all experiences of getting you on and everything is just great. Mm -hmm. Brilliant number one. Um, my number one is Expedition Everest, of course. <coughs> brilliant ride, brilliant ride. Um, one of the best roller coasters out there because it's got a great story, a great queue, great theming, um, and it's just fun. Um, it goes backwards, the backwards going round and up. Um, the g-forces that you get there just make that fantastic i love that i can ride it over and over again 
think six times in a row is, is my record. But Expedition Everest is my number one. Brilliant roller coaster. Um, Animal Kingdom um, is one of my favourite theme parks in the world. You don't like it? Hate it. Yeah. I get the theming on the outside, I get the whole theming going through, whatever. Uh, you know, the theming going up, but I just, ugh, it makes me ill. And there was some swearing from me, and I'm not a swearer, but I did swear on that ride. Yeah. I hated it, and I wanted to vomit. Never again. Not nope. for me, not for me. I'm so, not a coaster person, really, am I? No, you're not. We just love all of the animals, yeah. All of the animals in Animal Kingdom are... And the fact it's one of the warmest parks as well. Oh, it's, it's very <laughs> hot on there. So that's our top five rides in Animal Kingdom. Um, if you leave us a comment down below, tell us your top five rides in Animal Kingdom, some of the things that you love about that park. Um, we'd love to interact with you. Yeah, I was going to say, do you agree with me that Rafiki is a ride? But bear in mind, I don't ride Everest, so it, I had, and I don't ride Primeval World. I would say if you count on that as a ride, Maharaja, Jungle Trek and Gorilla Falls are, are rides as well. They're just walk-through rides, but... Um, Board of contention. Yeah. <laughs> so that's our top five rides in Animal Kingdom. Um, if you're not already subscribed, please subscribe down below. Don't forget to like the video if you've made it this far along. Keep making memories. And catch you later. For another top video. Stay safe. <laughs>